Greetings to you all, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Clara Azure, and I and my team here are here to educate you on the topic soil profile. The soil which we stand on gives us many more things than we can even think of. It is an essential part of nature. The topmost organic layer of the earth that covers the entire land and is visible to us is known as the soil. Many creatures, including plants and animals, grow and dwell on the surface layer of the earth's crust. This soil is composed of around 45% of minerals, 5% of organic matter, 25% of water, and 25% of air. One may ask, what is organic matter? They are the dead plants and animals that decay and combine with the soil. It also helps in plant growth. Soil profile is the vertical cross section of the soil, showing its different layers. This simply means if you dig deep down vertically into the earth, you begin to see different layers of the earth. Generally, there are four horizons of the, of the soil. They are the A horizon, B horizon, C horizon, and then the D horizon. The A horizon is known as the top soil. The B is known as the subsoil. The C as the weathered rock, and the D is known as the bed or parent rock. Let me add something to what she said. The horizon A is dark in color. The horizon A contains high amounts of organic matter. The horizon A is porous. Ladies and gentlemen, in order to test for the porosity of the A horizon, please, you need an empty cap. A sample of the A soil. Please hold it for me. Water. Now, firstly, the can. Please make holes under it. Pour the air horizon soil into it. Add an amount of water and wait for it. Please, you overpour the water. Please, after this, the observation is you will see that the water will be able to penetrate through the soil. This means it allows water to pass through it. Let me help you with the characteristics of the horizon. Okay. The horizon B soil is yellow in color and it contains less amount of organic matter and it is not porous. This is the horizon C. Also known as the weathered rock. The sea contains no amount of organic matter and does not help the plant grow because it does not contain organic matter that helps a plant grow. It is 60 feet deep into the soil, meaning you have to dig 60 feet deep into the soil before you find the origin sea, depending on where the land is. The origin sea has no specific color. I hope you can all see it has no specific color. It, it, is, it is permeable to water because it, can, it lets water pass through it. Characteristic of horizon D. It contains no organic matter. As a farmer, knowing about the soil profile will help you in many ways. Knowing of the porosity of the soil. For example, rice needs a lot of water. So you cannot go and then plant them in the top soil. They are going to dry up. So I'm begging all of you to take interest in the soil profile. It will help you in your cultivation very much, knowing the water capacity that each and every of the soil holds. All right, thank you. Well, let's go for them. Let's go for them.